Right now we're going to try uh, to go through how to figure out the occupant load of a room. And so in the fire code we see here this table 1004.1.2 and it's the maximum floor area allowance per occupant. And so you take the room that you're wanting to figure out what your occupant load is and look at the use of it and then come back to this chart and try to find out the most closely what it resembles. And so in our example here, we have a conference room. It's 20 by 40. And if we look on this example, assembly area with tables and chairs, and then we have a 15 net. So our occupant um, factor is 15. And so the way to figure the occupant load is you take the square footage of the room. So we're going to take 20 by 40 and the square footage of the room is 800 square feet and then we're going to take the occupant load factor which was 15 and divide that by 15 and it's going to give us an occupant load of 53.3 and so the occupant load is going to be 54 because this is we're going to round up you can't have a third of a person so we round it up to 54 and so here we have figured a conference room with tables and chairs uh, and occupant load numbers 54. The occupant load is 54. So in a conference room, anytime you have more than 49 people, we know a few different things. We have more than 49, and when we have that in a conference room, you're required to have two exits, and so this room would have to have two exits. The other thing that we know, because it has two exits, Anytime that happens, the doors have to swing in the direction of egress. If we only had 39 people, that door could swing into the room. And so because it's more than 49, the door has to swing out. So both doors will have to swing out. The other thing that we know, anytime two exits are required, the exit signs are required. So each one of these exit doors will have exit signs. And because it has more than 49, Emergency lighting is required, so we know we got two doors, they have to swing out, and that they're going to have exit signs with emergency lighting in this space.